What's going on guys? This is Khalif Fat Guy Skinny Wallet and guess what? I hit the gym for the first time in almost two months. Well the first workout that didn't have a lot of pain. So here I am doing squats and let me just lay out all the excuses up front. Alright guys, first I have no ankle mobility and I've been working on that. Um, but my lower back, my lower back is getting so tight um, from doing anything that I laid off with squats and deadlifts and bent over rows and all of that for like two months. So yeah, here I am trying to, um, basically what I'm doing now, this first set, I think this was the second or third set, um, the first one I filmed, I was just focusing on my back and I was just trying to, trying to move slowly, trying to just stay down in the hole and see how my back would, would react. And so doing that, of course, you see my knees are driving forward and you see how stiff my uh, ankles are. Um, when I come down, my heels are starting to raise up a little. Now you see I have the um, chucks on, but um, you know, it's just hard. So this time I said, okay, well, let me focus more on actually trying to point my toes up to give myself a, a cue to keep my uh, heels down and also to get a stretch on, on my ankles, stretch on the back. Um, and that's all I'm doing here. I only have 185 pounds. Um, you know, I actually didn't feel bad. This is half of my one rep max. So, you know, it didn't. I didn't feel bad about doing this. I actually had food poisoning the day before and had to jump in the gym um, this time. So I was just doing this just to see how it would feel and get back in the routine. Um, you're seeing bench press now, but I actually did overhead press first before that. You'll see overhead press after this, but. I actually did overhead press first in the gym and so my shoulders were really already feeling it from that um, same thing with bench press you know I usually over uh, emphasize the arch in my back and that usually um, messes me up um, as far as just the tightness in my back um, you know if I have a tight back it makes it worse so I couldn't do it as much then and also I was wearing a heart rate monitor um, you'll see at least one or two of the shots on overhead press that I actually look at the watch. Just curious to know what my heart rate was. Well, the problem is you don't wear it on your chest, you wear it below your chest. Exactly where the bar comes down when you're doing um, bench press. So the bar was actually hitting the heart rate transmitter every time it came down. And so that was such a huge distraction. And, I, and if you see, well here you see me failing, um, there was a couple things that went into that. Um, but anyway, you'll see sometimes I'm bringing the weight. If you look at my elbows, you look at my shoulder to elbows, it's much more than the 45 degrees that I usually have. Um, and that's because I'm saying I'm trying to just bring it into my chest above where that monitor is hitting. So anyway, guys, um, this is really just about me getting back in the gym first time in two months. And my back wasn't killing me. Um, yeah, I was happy about that. But yeah, here I am doing o overhead press. Like I said, I did these actually before bench press. But yeah, overall, you know, I, it felt great to be in the gym. Um, I burned 930 calories. I think I may stick a picture of that at the end. I'm not even sure. Um, just what the watch said. But yeah, it, it was a good workout. Um, of course, I was very weak because I had had 300 calories across two days because of the food poisoning. And I was, you know, vomiting and doing other stuff. I actually lost four pounds over that stretch of a little over a day you know um two days total um so yeah i ended up losing weight just from that couldn't eat anything i was very dehydrated but i still just wanted to get in the gym and i just said i'll go light and i'll do less volume so if you follow me on fitocracy i'll put the link below you'll get to see what the full workout was i also threw in some um skull crushers some barbell curls and some kneeling cable pull downs all right guys um so all I have to say, you see all the social media here, all of it's below in the description box. So make sure to like and follow where applicable.